certain students are, are rising to higher and higher levels, but other students are facing some real challenges. And that's where MASBA comes in. MASBA was birthed in 1970 in the middle of the civil rights era by trustees who didn't see the faces of our students reflected in leadership in the superintendents and school board members of Texas. They've been advocating for the needs of our Latino students and our English language learners in our Texas public schools. For 50 years now, MASBA has been dedicated to closing gaps in our Texas public schools for all students, but particularly for the Latino students who comprise the majority in our Texas public schools, and for the English language learners who are now 20% of our public schools. MASBA is about providing opportunities for children. Becoming a member of MASBA just gives us that, that unity with other like-minded uh, school boards, other like-minded organizations that are part of lifting our Latin children. Giving the student voice in what happens in the educational process is powerful. And the only way to do that is by being front and center in that leadership role and recognizing the responsibility that you have with every decision that you make. When I go to a MOSBA conference, it feels like home. It feels like I'm back in Brownsville with aunts and uncles and godparents, los padrinos, las madrinas. There's something about the Latin American culture that just embraces people, literally and figuratively. I really enjoyed the fact that one, I could meet people that were a lot like me, who were the same boat, and they became my mentors and my friends. So I can call somebody up that I meet through MOSBA and they'll mentor me. They'll say, well, this is what happened in our school district. You know, here's some advice for you. There's topics that we deal with here more in depth that you can't get anywhere else. So for example, we have a lot of classes on English language learners, how to help them be bilingual and biliterate and bicultural. While you get that in other places, the level of depth that you get at MOSBA can't be compared to anything else you see in any other organization. A lot of our population are economically disadvantaged. You don't have the parents that are there to help them. They don't understand the material. They don't have the education. So this is where we come to member districts, give them relevant information to help them close those achievement gaps, get the parents involved, get the different communication out there. And MOSBA gives you those tools on how to be able to to connect with your student to help them get to the next level. It's just that pride. I mean, I feel like I light up, you know, when I talk about representing this organization, helping member districts close those achievement gaps. It is our job to embrace children and to teach them about this wonderful country and the fact that their, their dreams can be fulfilled and that they can change the course of their life. They can change the course of their futures and their families. So what MOSBA provides is that support around that mission and the fact that you're not alone in the work, that you can pick up the phone, that you can call, that you can secure resources, that you can secure advocacy for the children of this great state. MASBA is all about el futuro. El futuro está en nuestras manos. How it is the future is in our hands as trustees and as superintendents. It's up to us to be crafting this next generation of leaders for our world. Let's be focused on them.